guys, welcome back to another Red Dog video, and today we are playing March of the Eagles. I never thought I would say that again after I played this at launch. We are genuinely going to go and try and play this game just to see how trash this is. Um, they did nothing on the game after it came out because everyone hated it. I mean, the concept for the game is good. Kind of like Napoleon Total War, but, you know, without the battles. Uh, EU4 in Napoleonic times, but EU4 already goes up to 1821, and then you've got Vicky too, so it's kind of in that grey area, really. Uh, but yeah, let's play uh, Let's play as France as well, just to see how it is, because France starts very strong. Whoa, more hints. You assume command of a country. Yes, we know, we know. Great Britain formed a coalition. Oh, Jesus. There's Napoleon. He's very good at everything. Decisions. Territorial swap with Bavaria. So it's very much just like EU4. Uh, create the Kingdom of Westphalia. Don't really want to do that. So can I declare war straight away? I guess I'm allied with you. Um, Spain? Do we declare war on Spain? can declare you are in a coalition with okay we're in a coalition with spain country is at war with britain is it just britain uh i guess so they have ships we have ships do you have good ships they have five ships aligned five light ships we have 12 transports okay i'm assuming our big navy's around here what's this it's just eight ships of the line okay let's go Ah, so annoying. You can't use WASD to move. Going to have to move my uh, keyboard. But yes, this game. Let's just see how trash it is. We're going to play for an hour just to see what it's like. Uh, I, a lot of years on from when it came out. They have done nothing. Look at these. These are like forts. Oh, you, you can select the garrison. These are all the troops. All One of them's led by Napoleon himself. Ships, let's go. Let's get around to there. 19 of you guys. You have lots of line, lots of cavalry, and some artillery, and a service group. Uh, ports are blockaded. 69 unemployed leaders. Wow. I can acquire new ideas. Okay. Apparently, we can acquire new ideas right at the start of the game. We've got 200 idea points. Don't know where they come from. Navy sail speed. I guess we want to take that. Army march speed. Oh, that's pretty good. Interest minus two. Land attrition. Let's go. We'll go for navy move speed, and maybe we'll be able to get across to Britain. Um, look at all these armies. It means nothing really. So that's our overview. Victory conditions. Budget. That's it. Like, oh my god, really? These are all our uh, troops. These are our ideas. And this is our diplomacy. Oh my god, are you joking? Are you sure that's... Oh my days. I knew this game was not deep at all. But to be that weak. That's crazy. We've got prestige. We've got money. We've got manpower. We've got two diplomatic points. And we got some war exhaustion. From blockaded point ports, I'm guessing. Uh, what do we do with these armies then? I mean, we send them across the ocean, obviously. Let's go. Let's play. Uh, speed up, maybe. Three. Spain, are you going to join my war? Spain. Call to arms. Very likely. Come on then, bro. Oh, Spain has honoured our coalition. Let's merge. What are you? Six ships of the line, three light ships. Let's go. Why don't anyone have full morale? I don't get that. Oh, I think we still, we've, we've got ten ships of the line. They've got eight. So let's go. Yes, Batal. They've got a lot better positioning than us. How are we not winning this? 
Can we roll some good rolls, please? Oh, four. Let's go. Defeat. We lost two ships. Of, ugh, you bastards. Uh, what if we get you on a ship? How do we put you on these ships? Um, go! I wonder whether the AI... Okay, what is that? They have a light ship. We have a lot of transports, but... Brunswick! Um, okay. Okay, Brunswick. Whatever. That's our land. Go and die then, I guess. Well, it doesn't look like we're getting across to Britain anytime soon, but it seems like we are probably going to be at war with Austria and all those those guys very soon. Look at this. We've got a nice army down here. Let's go. I think preemptive strike is the only option here. You guys, I need you guys to all link up. Austria. That's it. There's no problems with that action at all. No consequences. Uh, this is not EU4. That's for one thing. Let's go into Verona. We're probably attacking into a mountains there. But you three guys come as reinforcements to Mantua. Uh, on top of that, we will send down these two corps. Uh, okay, don't crash on me. March of the Eagles, you're a very old game. You should not crash. Uh, we'll bring them down to Strasbourg. I like that sound effect it does every time you move, to be honest. It's probably the only thing I like so far. And they are retreating heavily. Can we just walk through towns and stuff? Like, we don't need to worry about that fort, do we? Port, uh, fort, do we? Oh, we just took it. All right, okay, fine. You guys, you're going to march on Padua. Need you guys to come to Trieste. Is this it? Is this literally it? Wow, there's some depth in this game, guys. Oh, my days. Uh, what? Why is it changed the uh, mass tactics? What's going on with this fort then? No, we will not assault the fortress. They have 6,000 infantry inside the fortress. You guys come back to here then. We'll just go to Salzburg, I guess. <laughs> Trient, what about cities? Like, What do we have to do to take a city? Get the speed up. Uh, well, you, uh, we should assault. Nice victory. Up to Innsbruck. Uh, how are we doing in Brunswick? Both have 7% attrition, so let's assault. Oh my god, this is... What is this? Are you sure this is an actual real game? Paradox released this. How? I don't understand. Okay, keep blockading me there. That's actually nice of you. Uh, we'll send you there. You can stay up here. Where's Napoleon himself? Also, you've got to assign leaders to like every single little bit of the army. So, these guys do. We've got Masana down here. Louis Partner. He's not that good, actually. Uh, sort by offensive rating. Antoine de la Salle. Fantastic. Service group. I don't know what any of these do. You guys have no armies, uh, no leaders. Go for Joseph Albert and Guillaume Brun. Uh, you can go to Belluno as well. Oh, we didn't have Ven. What? Well, I thought we had Venice. Oh, we have to get on to Venice, right? Okay. Didn't see that that was a separate, uh, separate region. To be honest. Let's go take Trient. So Russia's involved now. Cool. I feel like Napoleon. Definitely. Uh, Diplo map mode. 
Austria is quite big. Prussia's got to join soon, though. So what we're going to do is send this up here to support the northern armies. Which one is uh, commanded by Napoleon? I'm assuming one of these. Napoleon? Napoleon? That's Davu. Right, we need to... These guys will be enough to to defend. So we'll send... Uh, oh, hello, Britain. 111,000 troops. We'll assemble an army to smash you back. Jean Toissard. You go to Lundberg. You guys come down to here. Wait, is that... Uh, it's a war of aggression against Austria. This is slightly different. So Austria can't join this war. What's our war score? 1%. 0% against Britain. Oh well. Okay, Austria does have some large armies coming around now. We will come down and try and take them out. Uh, we'll take out this one just after it's uh, tried to take Trient. Okay, they're all going to pile on Venice, aren't they? I don't mind that, to be honest. Uh, that's Brunswick. Okay. Yeah, we're doing alright. How do we recruit troops then? Uh, uh, oh my god, there's so many different troops. We'll get a guard brigade. They have a lot of cost. Uh, yeah, we've got enough gold and we've got enough manpower. So that's going to be a 33,000. This is going to be a very elite army. Get 40,000. Build them. And then we want some... Uh, Guard Chasseur à Cheval will go... We've got 40,000. We should probably get... Yeah, 7,000 of them. And then where... We'll get some supply brigades. Uh, guess them. And then where about... Uh, artillery. Where's our artillery? Art uh, artillery. And we'll go with horse artillery. Probably about 10,000 artillery, I'd say. Sounds about right to me. So, that is the depth of the game. Wow. Oh, my days. It's it's embarrassing. It's embarrassingly small, the amount of depth you have here. Brunswick are out. Get to Hanover. Oh, okay. Don't go to Hanover. You guys man here, and we'll attack them from both angles. Battle of Padua was a defeat. Ah. Okay, where's me big army? Come on then, bro. We are the French, so I'm hoping we'll win this. These things mean nothing to me right now. Oh no, we are losing. Let's uh, retreat then. Oh, we can only retreat to there, can we? Right. Let's get to Padua. Looks like we're destroyed in Italy. Yep, get out. You can only retreat to like one place next to you for some reason. Uh, no, let's go. Let's go here. If we can. Portugal have joined now. Um, that's fine. You guys come around this way. We'll uh, retreat to Geneva. In this area of the map. Uh, so you guys. Go around this way. Oh, we've got uh, that's a brigade constructed. So we've got a few brigades popping out. These guys, I think we send you south. You're kind of needed down there, aren't you, bros? Right. Let's go. Big army battle. Let's see the great depth of this game. Yes, numbers, numbers, numbers going down. What is this? Combat. Okay, it's a hint, right? Yeah, my army's in battle. What about our rolls? Where are our rolls? One. We rolled one. Right, one. Six. Come on. We're breaking the center. Yes. Now we will destroy them. The stupid British. You got some good traits. Yeah, nice. We will drive them into the ocean. Yes. Let's go. Yes, they're fully destroyed. Oh. Wow. Wow, we. Uh, these guard battalions. You can't. Oh, can you? You can press shift. 
Uh, we'll uh, go to Ream. Yes, everybody, come to Ream. Yeah, I can understand why this game is so... Why I played it for about two hours and was like, what the fuck is this? Oh, dear. It's shocking. It is shockingly bad already. We've got Austria go taking out uh, Bologna. Or Italy, apparently. Oh, what's this? They're offering... Brunswick will concede defeat. No. Brunswick, I will offer you peace for your land. We can't do that, apparently. Nope. Oh, well. Well, we'll leave you in the war for war score, then. Uh, right. This army. We are suffering attrition like this, but who cares? 0.3%. It's not even bad. Everyone get to Ream. Everyone go. Oh, God. This game, man. It's so bad. It's already boring. <laughs> it's already boring. I'm sure it's boring for you guys to watch as well. Like, I'm already bored playing this game. And it's about... What is it? 17 minutes in. Piedmont. Okay. Who are you? Where are you? Down here? Oh, oh well. Whatever. We're not going to get there. We won the Battle of Brunswick. And we need to go destroy those troops. Where are they retreating to? Let's go. They should destroy them fully now. No, how are you not destroyed fully? Oh my god, that's too much information. Get to Verden. Brunswick, you going to Brunswick? Oh, they accepted. They ex what? I didn't even send that offer though. Apparently this is our land now. Right, great. Okay. <laughs> oh, this game is just silly. Just really silly. Right, we will merge these guys. We have some guards. We have a large cavalry, very large artillery. Oh my god, this is just cavalry and artillery. That's not right, is it? That shouldn't be like that. They're very artillery heavy, but we're going to go for it anyway. Philippe Duchesne. 443. Seems pretty good. 454. 554. We're going to go try and get them before they escape. We'll send you forward as well. Yes, we won. Uh, you guys are running that way. You guys are running that way. So, we will... We will oblige you by coming down here as well. If you're going to split your armies up like that, fantastic. Britain, have you invaded anywhere else? No. Trash. Where are the rest of these units then? So, that's all the cavalry and artillery. The guards aren't here yet. So, the guards are going to pop out very soon. Battle of Firenze. Oh, dear. This is This is trash. Oh, they're attacking... The British are attacking the papacy. That's fine by me. I don't care. <laughs> the Austrians have a lot of troops here. We'll come up to Pisa. Oh, we have something happened. These units are out of supply. Right. Uh, we will split them in half then, if we can do that. Can we split you in half? I don't want to create a new unit. I just want to split them in half. You joking? I can't even do that. Uh, right. That's so dumb. We go to Sur. We get a couple of guard units across. We'll get their horses. Why are they all messed up as well? Like, why are they not together? Get a few of the artillery. More horses. We'll just get as many as we can across, really. Oh, this game is already trash, man. So trash. Ridiculously trash. 
Like, so bad. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be this bad. I thought there'd be a little bit of fun in it. Doesn't seem like it. Genuinely, oh, what are these? Light infantry. Oh, we've got, oh, we got something. Right. We'll split them in like that. You guys go to Hanover. You guys probably get supply in Bremen, I'm guessing. Peace officer from Russia. Ha ha ha! White peace from Russia already. What is going on? Do you resupply in cities? Is that the deal here? Applied from Bremen. Right, where's Bremen? Yeah, we're getting supply back now. You guys supplied from Hanover? Yep, yeah, cool. That's good. Right, we'll come forward. You guys come here. Try and seize those guys. Yes, we are pushing the Austrians back. Fantastic. That's what it's all about. I don't know where they're going and why they're so scared because they had a lot of troops around here a minute ago. When are these uh, when are these guard units getting recruited then? How do I find that out? Do we not have enough money to recruit them? The troops will expire. Hmm. I don't get it. Where where do we find out where I've been recruiting troops? I've not achieved naval dominance. We know that. They, oh my god, there's so little depth in this game. It's crazy. You take Padua, I'll take Venezia. Is this it? Like, where are the guard troops? Budget... Military maintenance. Recruitments. We're not recruiting any, apparently. I don't get it. Uh, right then. We'll get, try and get elite infantry brigades. Yeah, build them all around. Okay. Too many. That's it, and that new army will come out. We won't have any manpower left after that, though. That's the one bad thing. You guys come forward. Oh, God. I said I was going to play an hour of this. But this is trash. This is so bad. Oh, I can't believe they released this game. Jesus. Yeah, you got traits. Wow. How do we find out what your traits are, bro? Well, look here. Uh, you have to go over that to see their traits? Uh, whatever. Jean-Baptiste Bernadotte. One of the marshals de France. Peace officers. Everyone wants to peace out anyway. So, okay. And then also, why... Oh, we're on 31% manpower. Uh, we're on 31% war score already. Pretty easy. What's going on in Venezia then? Oh, they have a big garrison. We've got a lot of uh, artillery though. Can we bombard or something? I guess not. How do we win this? How do we win this? It doesn't show various siege events. That's what all it says. Various siege events can make you... But what are those events? Fortress has sustained light damage, right? This is just horses and artillery, so... Should probably, you know, just leave the artillery here. Detach... Uh, no. We're not allowed to... St uh, this stack to march to the sound of guns. Okay, so they will actually react normally. Um, detach the slowest brigades. Yep. So that's the 10k of artillery. So we'll just stand over here and not get any retrition. Yep, fantastic. When are those guard units going to be done? White piece. Fantastic. More prestige for us. 
we're winning against Austria as well somehow. Don't know where they're bringing these troops from. Probably up towards Copenhagen. We'll only use that 40,000. Austria formed a coalition. We're already at war with you, Austria, so we're going to be at peace with you soon. Go to Verdun, that might be where they're going. Go to Brunswick. We'll stay in Hanover. We need to get those supply levels up. Apparently, we just run out of supplies straight away. It's a bit silly, really. They're going to go there, aren't they? Yep. That should be them destroyed. Oh, how are they not destroyed yet, man? You get your supplies up, if you can. And oh, we've got no leaders in this army. saint Joseph Albert. Maman. Yes, oui, Maman. Andre. Yes, all the marshals. Fantastic. Looks like the reserves is the main leader. For some reason. So how are we doing here, then? Okay. The attacking forces are too small to do any... It's just, it's just all artillery, though. Oh, well. Well, just stick, just stick you on there. It doesn't matter anyway, does it? A great deal of damage. The wall is breached. Right. Yeah, but why is their morale not going down? I don't get it. You guys. Sustain light damage. Oh, we can get an idea. Fantastic. Get movement up. Fantastic. Boom, boom. Right, we'll get all these guard regiments in. Fantastic. Let's go. We will meet in Rima, but probably not the best place to meet, but oh well. And then when we've got that guard, uh, the guard regiments ready to go, we'll go. We'll go and kill these blasted Prussians. I guess we'll go to Austria, actually, because we need another army down there. I have supplies up now. Nope, they're... F Where are you going? Why are they just ping-ponging around? Yeah, so out of supply. I'm guessing it's these guys down here. Yeah, very low supply. A great deal of damage. The wall is breached, yeah, okay. Well, we'll send uh, the infantry corps across then. And uh, we'll assault. Yes, let's go! Dead. Sorted. Fantastic. Battle of Padua. Twice. You can't come here. Got there just in time. How's this? Fair amount of damage. Is the wall breached though? The garrison lacks supplies. They should be getting attrition then. I, I don't get this at all. Next event in three days. Well, let's see that. What? How? I don't, I don't understand. Can never see, can never see why this game didn't take off. Jesus. It's trash. <laughs> it is so trash. Right, we'll get Trieste. That'll somehow get us supplies, I'm guessing. Right, you guys. Do we have Napoleon? Jean Lan? Murat? Oh, get, oh, we'll get Lan commanding the whole thing. We'll get Murat commanding the center. Ney, my man. I love a bit of Ney. And then uh, Bessier. What's this? Uh, defensive, we don't want that. Maneuver. We want maneuver on the side, right? We'll get Gazan in. Gazan. Don't need you up there. You can come down to Austria, actually. Can you just, like, go to Vienna? Yeah, you can, actually. Just go to Vienna. <laughs> Let's see. Could we... Okay. Oh, the HRE is involved now. Right, that's the HRE. Right. Okay, great. Uh, well, let's see whether we could sue for peace with Austria. Uh, I would like this area, Padua. They would accept Trieste, this area. 
this area. We need something here to take. We don't have Venice, do we not? I thought we did. I thought it said we did. We do. Why can't we take Venice then? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, God. This game is easy. It's so silly. <laughs> it's ridiculously easy. All right, Trieste. We need to break down the fortress. Oh, yeah, we have no infantry in that division. <laughs> Where are you guys? I want to just get you guys basically to Vienna. Take Vienna and then... Uh, then let's end the campaign. <laughs> Why haven't you been destroyed yet? That's what I want to know. Okay, there we are. Overwhelmed. Uh, the HRE, which is down here. Can't even get to it. But we'll keep these armies up here anyway. Uh, fully supplied because Prussia will declare war on us at some point very likely if you know your history Trieste okay we can't assault Trieste we'll go to Lyons and then Trieste ourselves let's speed it up a bit slow isn't it victory a new king of Holland Yeah, of course we'll get our brother Louis on the throne. That was actually the uh, Napoleon the Third's grandfather, right? Or uh, I believe. So let's go and just take Vienna. Probably going to be easy. We've run the siege of Trieste. Somehow it doesn't say that their morale's going down or anything. Like I don't get it, but okay. Yeah, all we have in this army is cavalry, by the way. So, cavalry and artillery. So, I don't know how we're winning any battles. Because we should get absolutely shredded. It like, doesn't say... It says the morale is fine. Garrison lacks surprise. Oh, yes. We, oh, they took Trieste back. They just assaulted it straight away, I'm guessing. No, don't take Trieste back. Towers! Yeah, we don't have uh, enough troops to assault it. Probably taking lines though. Let's go. Can we catch these guys? I hope we can. All right, we'll come up to Graz. How's it looking in Vienna? They've got 10,000 troops. Uh, when we've got a breach, we will go. Garrison does lack supplies. And yes. Hmm. Prussia, you decide not to join, did you not? Oh well. We've got Austria be destroyed. Fantastic. We are the great French in this amazing game. Oh, so much depth, man. So much depth. Look at this diplomacy scene. Wow. Wow, look at these ideas. French ideas. Ooh. Army frontage. Artillery attack. Monthly idea points. Guard attack. Starting experience. This is a very uh, elite army here, so I'm hoping they'll do well. Have we not... I uh, guess we've not got that much artillery, so... Light damage. Oh yeah, this army can't do anything, really. Should probably go up to Salzburg. Or Linz. Let's go and try and cut these guys off. Where has the Austrian army gone? Did we kill it all? Because I don't remember... Killing it all. Oh, we've got loads more uh, guard regiments coming out. Good. Send you down to join the fight. Go to Venice. Uh, you two too. To Venice. And wait there. We don't. We we need you to join this army really because they have no infantry. <laughs> yeah, we won that. Fantastic. We'll go kill these guys. Just kill all the Austrian armies and we'll win. I mean, we'll win anyway, but... The wall is breached, right? Let's try. Let's go. This is us. Ooh. Oh, we cracked. We cracked under the pressure, but we might win still. I think we're going to win. Yes, the assault of Austria! The assault of Vienna. Oh! Okay, okay. I don't know why there's there's always seems to be two battles. Yes, Vienna is ours. We 
on that one as well. Three battles on the same map. That should be like 100% war score really now. Sweden's joined. Oh well. Sue for peace. I would like this, 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 this. And we can't take Vienna. Uh, and then uh, what about other stuff? Uh, no, I don't care about anything else. What about monies? Give us monies! Wow, we are now France. <laughs> oh dear. You sh this is so easy. This is so silly. Oh. Well, we've concluded our first big war anyway, guys. So, genuinely, I don't want to play anymore. That was so boring. <laughs> that was one of the most boring... That is the most boring Paradox game I've ever played. And it's no wonder why they cancelled this. Why they didn't want to carry it on. It's trash. There's no depth. The army thing is just ridiculous. Like, okay, you get these different units. But wow, oh, that's fun. It's not. Because in a game like this, okay, it's fun in Rome Total War. Or Total War where you're actually fighting the battles. And you have about, you know, a few armies. Two full stack armies at the start of the game. Early game. But with this... Of all these armies, like EU4, how are you going to be going through these and, and, and mixing them up and, and stuff? You're going to spend hours doing it if you wanted to. Like, and that's just false depth. It's depth there for no reason. Okay, you could have a normal infantry and a guard infantry and, and one cannon and one cavalry, like in EU4. I know that wouldn't be accurate to the time period, but, like, for an EU4 type game... To work here, that would have to have happened. And it would have to have had so much depth. Like, look at this budget. What do I do here? Right, I could take a loan. That's the only thing I can do. Province tax. Yeah, how do we do that then? He collects taxes, right? So you can't change them. Harbour fees. Loans. Right, oh, yeah, let's take a loan. Whoa, we got a loan. Woo, we now got inflation though. Oh, no. Where's this? Where even is the inflation? Satellites are giving us money. That is one of the... There's so little depth. It's ridiculous. It's so easy. All right, here's your ideas, but you're set with them. You just choose different ones. Right, right oh, great. Thanks. I, like, the, the thing with Paradox games is you want choice. And this gives you no choice. Like, nothing. Like, hardly anything. Dominance, right? Oh, we have land dominance. Oh, but we don't have ship dominance. Land dominance. Russia has second most. And Prussia, Warsaw has a bit of land dominance. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> land and naval dominance is holding a number of important strategic cities. Right, okay. Great. Yeah, we've got some strategic cities. Brilliant. Oh, wow. Whoa, victory conditions. We're only 64% towards the victory conditions. Like, what? We have to get the rest of these? Like, what's that? Rome. Uh, Castle, Frankfurt, Warsaw. I mean, we'd get these so easily if we just went to war with Prussia. Just take those Prussian ones. Oh, my God. I, I can't believe it. <laughs> you know, when I came on this game, I thought... It's not going to be as bad as I remember. That was genuinely what I was thinking. It's worse. It's worse. When you play the new Paradox games, how much depth and meaningful depth is in there and meaningful choices you have to make. This has none of that. Look at these, right? These, these are the decisions. Territorial swap with Bavaria. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, no. Oh, that's fantastic. Create this kingdom of Italy. We've got to control Milan. Oh, wow. Create the kingdom of Westphalia. Oh, no. Oh, dissolution of the Holy Roman Empire. Holy Roman Empire has three regions. What are you talking about? I'm genuinely annoyed by this game. <laughs> like, this game has got me to the point where I'm annoyed by it. Because it's that bad. <laughs> Paradox, what were you thinking? 
Surely this was just a cash-in. Like, this cannot be anything more than a cash-in. Uh, these are my coalition members. Wow. Ooh. Look, country. Look, my land dominance. Oh, look, we... Oh, no. oh, that makes sense. Those numbers mean something. No, they don't. They don't mean fuck all. Oh, my God. This is bad. Huh. Denmark's attacking Sweden. That's funny. At least I got a slight bit of amusement in that a country that doesn't exist is attacking Sweden. But yeah. Um, I also got to kill a lot of British people, which is fun. Um, don't quote me on that. No, I'm joking. Um, I'm just, I, there's nothing more to say. It's This game is trash. Do check out all my other videos, guys. See whether we play any more old games like this. But we've been playing Rome Total War Remastered a lot. And ranking some games. Ranking the factions in Rome Total War. Ranking the factions in Divide and Conquer. Ranking the Total War games as well. So please do check that out guys. And I will see you again on the next video.